going to make a cimbella. It's a, an Italian dish, it's like a pastry ring. And uh, about 20 years ago, I took a book out of the library called Essentials of Classic Italian Cookery. And it was by a lady called Marcella Hazen, who apparently is a very, very famous Italian cook. She lived in America all her life and uh, is very, was very renowned out there. And she died last year. But I was just thinking about it the other day. And of course, once you go online, I only ever made it the once and left the book back to the library. And then I was thinking, when I was thinking about it, I just tried it online and of course I was able to find the recipe. Uh, so I'm going to make it tonight anyway. So here we have eight, six tablespoons of one stick of butter, which is melted. That's ready to go in. I have four cups of regular flour in there. I have three and a half, a three quarters of a cup of granulated sugar in there. Three and a half teaspoons of baking powder that's in there. I have a little bit of salt and the peel of one gray, of one lemon, uh, grated without digging into the pith beneath. And then a half a cup or a quarter cup of lukewarm milk two eggs, a heavy baking tray, which is oiled and then I've just it with flour. And uh, then you've got, you need your two eggs and you take a little bit of one of the yolks and put it in there with a little bit of water. So I'm going to use that to um, coat the top of the, the ring when I've made it so it'll go nice and glossy in the oven. So that's it, I'm going to start mixing it all together now because I'm going to turn on the machine. So I'll come back to you when I have everything combined. Hi there, I'm back again. Okay, well I've, I've brought the, put all the dough out into the table and I kneaded it into um, like a, just for a couple of seconds. You don't have to knead it very heavily apparently. And then I rolled it into a kind of a sausage shape and then I pop, popped it onto my tray here and I have put it into a circle. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just use that bit of egg yolk with a tiny bit of water in it to um, paint the top of it so that we get a nice finish when it comes out of the oven. So here we go. Let me see. I'm just going to paint this and this is going to go into the oven for about 35 minutes and it's the oven is at about 200 degrees and uh, we'll see what happens then it's always really interesting when you haven't done something before or not for a very long time to see how it turns out but um simple to make so far so we'll see the proof is in the eating and i'll be back later on to uh, let you see the finished product now good morning so this has been resting overnight and I've just cut a slice here of my Kimbella and uh, it's, I just took, took a little piece there and it's delicious. It's very lemony and it's kind of like between a bread and a cake texture. And uh, I remember that from the last time when I, I did it so many years ago, I froze some of it. So I'm going to do the same with this. And I reckon this would be del delightful with, with some butter on it, say for your allowances or um, I remember I had lemon curd on it the last time and it was gorgeous. So. Uh, I enjoy baking that. I'm going to do it again. Maybe I look for a better, better effort the next time. And uh, so keep calm, carry on baking and see you soon again.